Okay, family. Now is the time to armor up and defend our principles and our country. Now is the time for the good men and women of our country to let the light of Jesus Christ shine through them. Father God, I ask to be filled with your love to overflowing in Jesus' name. I want to operate out of your love each and every day. I surrender completely to you and your will for my life. I ask you to let your Holy Spirit speak this prayer through me against the powers and principalities that come against your children and our great nation. Father, in Jesus' name, by prayer and faith, I put on your whole armor that I might stand against the wiles of the devil. I put on your helmet of salvation, that the same mind be in me that is in Christ Jesus. I put on your breastplate of righteousness, the righteousness of Christ. I put on the girdle of truth. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life, as it is written in John 14 and 6. The truth, integrity, and the holiness of God. I put on your sandals of the gospel of peace. Help us to stand on the solid ground of Jesus Christ and to be as wise as serpents and as harmless as doves. You have given us the power to trample upon the serpents and scorpions that come our way. And today is the day that we do that. Help us to stand on the solid ground of Jesus. Above all, I put on your shield of faith to quench every fiery dart, arrow, spear, and missile the enemy shoots our way. No weapon formed against us shall prosper. And Lord, I equip and draw out your powerful sword of the Spirit activated by your Holy Word that's alive and powerful and sharper than any two-edged sword, as is written in Hebrews 4 and 12, our offensive and defensive weapons. Father, in the name of Jesus, I ask that you keep the same hedge of protection around me, my family, my mind, my heart, our country, and our leaders, as my and my emotions, as is written in Job 1 and 10. Father, in Jesus' name, I ask you to keep an encampment of your powerful angels around us all, 24 hours a day, as is written in Psalms 34, 7, and 91, 11, and 12. Father, I just praise you and give you glory and thank you that your glory is my rear guard, as is written in Isaiah 52, 12, and 58, 8. In Jesus' name, I ask you to surround me with a supernatural wall of fire to insulate me and my loved ones and our country from any assaults from our enemies. Father, in Jesus' name, by faith, I claim your promise to be my shield and protector, as written in Genesis 15 and 1 and Psalms 3 and 3. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command my thoughts to come under the obedience and captivity to Jesus Christ, as is written in 2 Corinthians 10 and 5. In the name of Jesus, the name that is above every name, and all things is written in Philippians 2 and 9, 10, and Ephesians 1, 20 through 23. I bind up every unclean spirit and assignment coming against me, my family, and my brethren, and our country, and its leaders, from, by, or through anyone or anything, named or unnamed, known or unknown, seven generations back. In the name of Jesus, I bind up the principalities, the powers, the rulers of the darkness of this world, spiritual wickedness, and hosts in high places. I bind up the prince of the power of air in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy, holy name. I bind up the strong man, the old man, and every prince and stronghold, the spirit of confusion, illusion, and delusion in Jesus' name. I bind up the witches and the warlocks in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name. I bind up the soothsayers in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name. I bind up the spirit of infirmity, sickness, disease, pain, and addiction, affliction, calamity, the devourer, the destroyer, the accuser, the deceiver, the corrupter, and every spirit of poverty in the name of Jesus. I bind up the spirit of strife and division, backbiting and gossip, critical and judgmental spirits, spirits of resistance and hindrance. In Jesus' name, I bind up every spirit of retribution, revenge, and retaliation in all the lying, seducing, deceiving spirits of deception. In the name of Jesus, I bind up every root of fear, doubt, unbelief, discouragement, and every deadly deed from despair to depression, the spirit of pride, rebellion, disobedience, self, ego, independence, unforgiveness, bitterness, lust, 
and the flesh, the spirit of Babylon and Baal, we bind you in your gateways. We bind you who come against us this evening and who come against us in the future. We bind you in the name above every other name, our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And a man that you release those in your grip, in Jesus Christ's most powerful name, the Lord Jesus Christ rebuke you, you evil, unclean spirits. We come against you and we crush you under our foot. I loose in the name of Jesus Christ, God's protection, God's gift of wisdom, knowledge, faith, healing, miracles, prophecy, and discerning spirits, the gift of tongues and interpreting tongues, the gift of administration and the gift of helping others. I loose in the name of Jesus the fruits of the Spirit of love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, and temperance. I loose and accept in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name, deliverance, freedom, and liberation, hope, gladness of heart, healing and wholeness, mercy and grace, blessings and favor, restorations of the years that the locusts have eaten, the resurrection power of Jesus Christ, the mighty harvest and a boldness to witness for Jesus Christ. All glory to God the Father and praise and glory to God for arming us and equipping us to be more than victors in Jesus Christ. Most holy, holy, holy name. Amen and amen. We come against you this day. In Jesus Christ, most holy, holy name. And I proclaim victory in Jesus Christ, most holy, holy name. He is coming to judge. And he will start in the house of the Lord first. And he is going to look to see which of his children has, has made a stand and has faith. And I want you to join me and be one of those one of his children that is standing with him and is showing that we have faith. No matter what the odds are, no matter who is saying they're going to come against us, we shall stand for our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. In Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name, have no fear, stand with me. We are victorious through him and by him. He goes before us and makes a crooked pathway straight. He is our rear guard. He is our high tower. All we must do is have our faith and stand in Jesus' name. Glory to God in the highest. I pray for all my brothers and sisters out there to get his spirit and strength and know that he will never leave us nor forsake us. In Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name, stand with us this day, my brethren. Stand this day in victory. Amen and amen. Amen.